everybody, welcome to the next project. Thanks for joining me. We have an upgrade to the grip, which is a 3D printable sanding tool that you can use for prepping frets for polishing or maybe even for doing your polishing. We previously released version 17 to the wild. A lot of people have been showing interest in it. A few people have said they printed out multiple copies and loaded each individual copy with a different grit paper to do their prep work for polishing. I think that's a great idea. I'll have to do that myself. Well, here we are. We've got version 18 now, which has a number of little um, upgrades. First is the housing. Even though it is largely the same as version 17, it now comes in four sizes. Narrow, medium, wide, which is the original width, and extra wide, which is this concave surface down here. Also updated is the reel or spool assembly. The reel itself has a slit in it now which should help load the paper into the grip itself. And the thumb knob has been updated to fit the new and improved reel. So the total spool assembly is different. If you've already printed version 17 housing, you can just print version 18, the spool and reel assembly. It will fit in the version 17 still. You could just print the innards and it'll go right in. Uh, we're gonna take a look at how this loads up and everything as we start or continue. The next project. All right, everybody, use your imagination just a little bit. Pretend this is actual sandpaper, 600, 800, 1,000, 1,200, 1,500, 2,000, 2,500 grit paper, whatever you might be using. Cut it to a two and a half inch wide strip by whatever length. This is eight and a half inch length on the paper. Fold about a three eighths to half inch lip on one end and then roll it up. I use a Phillips style screwdriver the shaft of it, roll it up nice and tight. And now what we're going to do is load the rolled up paper into the housing. Now, as you do this a couple times, you'll probably develop a better system for loading, but this is just to get you started. I tuck the paper into one side of the housing, slide the rolled up piece of paper into the top feed part of the housing, and then tuck that folded piece into the slit that is in the uh, spool assembly into the end of the reel itself. And voila, that's pretty much it. It is loaded. Now, you don't want to cut your paper wider than two and a half inches because it will bind up in the ends of the spool assembly and it'll kind of jam up. So make sure it's two and a half inches wide or a little bit narrower. It'll be good. Here we're looking at some previous footage from version 17. Again, it works identically to 17. You do a little bit of sanding, then you advance the paper by twisting the thumb knob about, uh, you know, give it about a quarter turn or maybe less. And you'd basically just need to get the worn out paper out of the way so you can use fresh new paper again. You can rock the tool side to side a little bit. If you have scratches in the sides of your frets you need to take out. A couple people had mentioned that they've printed out multiple versions of 17 and they're loading each one up with different paper. I think that's a great idea. You'll probably be seeing me do that in the very near future. This is pretty much it. And, uh, you know, when you get done with whatever you're doing here, it's really easy to unload. You basically, when you get to the end of the length of paper, you just pull it out just like that. And that's about all there is to it. We are at the end of this quick update video. I hope you find this tool useful and helpful. Let me know if you have any um, feedback. I'd love to hear from everybody how it's working for you, if there need to be other advances and improvements. But I think we're getting pretty close to having a really great tool here. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for future notifications, hit the thumbs up button to let YouTube know you like content like this. Please leave comments. I love hearing from everybody all around the world. Until next time, Take care of yourself and those around you. Bye.